It was his gift, and he was the best. What I'm saying is just assume that this guy can hear and see everything that you're doing. He's a born tactician. Every move that he makes, it means something. That's a pawn being moved off the board. And if I were you, I'd be looking for the next piece. No, you can't stop him. What's up, people? Supreme Decisions here, and today I want to come to you. While this is one of the 100, it's actually something that brought up a memory from a conversation a couple of friends and I were having. And the context of it was choosing to win every battle or wanting to win the war. Now, the context of it was a game. And for me, I play everything like I'm playing chess because my whole goal is to win the war. I give a shit about losing one or two battles. I want to win the war. I am focused on my objective. Now, with that being said, there was a situation in a game where I chose to lose a battle because it gave me a strategic advantage in the war. And it was funny because a couple of my friends looked at me crazy whenever I said it. It wasn't something that I had to think about because it was something that is just part of who I am and what's in me. Now, one of my friends that disagreed with me, he cracked up laughing. So I went to explain the reasoning. He said, no, I don't need an explanation. I understood exactly what it was that you were doing the second you said it. Now, the reason why I bring that up is understanding when you're going into court and you're going into trial or you're pushing towards a trial, understanding pushing towards that trial is what gives you a distinctive advantage. That's why I told you about the preliminary hearing, which you're going to lose 99% of the time. That's a battle. You're going to lose it, except the loss, because it pushes you closer to war and winning the war. The greatest objective of that is understanding the reason why they lose. They have to convince 12 people to see the world as they do. Your advantage, you need one. And I, for one, I find it a lot less difficult to convince one person versus attempting to convince 12. But that's where it comes in, understanding who you are painting the picture for, and nobody wants to hear your opinion, but they want to hear your side. Understand this, they don't want to hear your opinion, but they want to hear your side. Be able to paint the picture so that way, even losing one or two battles, you still stay focused on winning the war. That should be your objective each and every time out, to win the war. Now, that's just me, but I ask, but that's what I got for you today. Love you guys, keep donating. Apple Pay, Venmo, Cash App, Google Pay, and now Zelle. It's up on the screen, love you guys. Let's keep moving, let's keep going, let's keep growing. Till next time.